Hi guys. It's been forever since I've made a video. Um, last video I made was of my pregnancy announcement and that was forever ago. Um, you know, and honestly, I thought I was going to be making, um, you know, my plan was that I was going to be making weekly videos of my pregnancy journey. But you see the way I was feeling the first, like, four months of my pregnancy was really bad. So, um, yeah, that never happened. I just didn't have the energy to upload because I was in bed all day and throwing up. <laughs> I don't even want to think about it it was it was yeah my pregnancy at the beginning was not the best but that's all gone thank god and now i am feeling so much better and i'm actually in a stage where i get to enjoy pregnancy and not be so miserable so anyways um where do i begin I'll start off obviously with the beginning and like i said my first i'll say up to 19 weeks yeah about like 19 20 weeks i was nauseous you know there was not a day where i didn't throw up um and i was just i went to the hospital twice because i was so dehydrated and nothing would stay i would just like puke everything and it was it was just not pretty you guys it was i um i lost a lot of weight so um but I've gained it all back quickly now um so that was up to 19 weeks and I think um like 20 and from where I'm at right now I am 27 weeks I am feeling so much better this is my last week on my second trimester you guys oh I never showed you guys my um gender reveal I was just with my immediate family and um I'm gonna insert a little clip here and I found out the gender of my baby at 16 weeks. So here it is. Okay, okay, ready? No, 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 Wait. no, no. 10! What are you trying to do? Hey, put him in. Okay. Take the door away from me. We got technical difficulties here. present and hold it. Ready? We're at 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. Two, two, one. What happened, Beth? It's fun with the little girl. Yeah. 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 Let me see. Where's the? Yeah, those two. Let me see. Yeah. Baby crying. Okay. I can tell. I don't know. <laughs> it just says. It's a girl. It's a girl. You can see, I was surprised, you guys. I thought I was having a boy. I was so certain I was having a boy. Um, in my head, when I was opening that box, I was like so certain I was gonna see blue balloons. So when I opened that box and I saw pink balloons, I was like my mouth dropped. I was just like, oh, I was, I was happy either or. If I was having a boy or a girl, I was just, you know, I was, of course I was gonna be happy, but. You know, me thinking that I was having a boy and then seeing pink balloons, it was just like, uh. So, I am having a girl. And, um, yeah, and I'm so happy that I'm having a girl. Her name is going to be Sara Sertuche. And it's going to be spelled with a Z. In English, it's going to be pronounced Zara. 
and I'm so I'm so happy you guys because if you guys know me I am very girly it's gonna be so much fun and I'm just I'm just so happy you guys right now I'm very happy and of course I still want my boy in the future but having a girl I'm just I'm so excited and just especially feeling her kicks it's just the best feeling ever i remember the first time i felt her kicks i was at work and i was sitting at my desk i was i think 18 weeks and i was at my desk and i just felt like a kick um and i wasn't sure you know because i was always very curious on how i was gonna feel or what it feels like to you know feel your baby kick for the first time you don't know what to expect so i was not sure if it was a kick or a gas or something so i called albert and i told him and i'm like i think i felt the baby kick and then sure enough days passed and i just felt it more and more and i figured that was the baby's kicks and now i feel her all the time and it's just it never gets old you guys i think i'm getting i don't want to get emotional but it's hold on i don't want to cry yeah it's just so it's just it's crazy to think because oh my god i can't believe i'm getting emotional i wasn't planning to cry today but it's crazy to think because a few months ago i uploaded a video of how me and albert were trying to have a baby and then now i'm here telling you guys okay i'm back um so as i was saying you know it's been about a year i think since i uploaded the video of of me talking about my infertility struggles and how Albert and I were trying to have a baby for about three years now and you know and now I'm sitting here talking about my pregnancy and talking about how I can feel my baby girl's kicks and it's just very surreal to me and then I just you know I'm just very thankful and I'm thankful every day for this little miracle that I'm holding um, and I know there's a lot of you guys out there that are struggling and are trying to have a baby. So you guys just, I know it's not easy hearing, um, you know, it's all in God's timing, but it really is you guys, it really is. And I'm so thankful that I am pregnant now and not three years ago, you know, um, it just wasn't it just wasn't the time and now now that i'm here i i see it i see it you know and i'm just very thankful you guys so don't lose hope you will have your little miracle <sighs> and i'm just very happy right now you guys um just i just can't wait in uh, three months i'll be having a little girl which is crazy to think I am due the end of January, January 30th to be exact, so we'll see when she wants to come, either beginning of February or even like two weeks earlier. I'm just excited. So that's where I'm at right now, you guys. I am 27 weeks. I will be entering my third trimester next week, and I'm just excited. I'm excited to see my belly grow, but I'm also scared because I'm scared i feel like my belly is so huge i'm like and i'm only six weeks you guys six weeks and i'm only six months and i feel like my belly is huge so i can only imagine when i am nine months i don't know how my belly is gonna take this and i really hope my belly button doesn't pop do belly buttons pop on all pregnancies i don't know but anyways i'm wearing a fitted dress on purpose because i normally wear i'm always wearing like very flowy loose dresses so i feel like you can't really see my belly but i'm wearing this fitted dress so you guys can see it hold on so 27 weeks Now you get, now you see her. Can you, right? I'm trying to tippy toe, but there she is, you guys. There is Sada popping out. Hey guys, that is all. I hope you guys enjoyed, and till next time.
which I don't know when that would be, but hopefully soon and not like in five months. Okay, bye. So I'm laying down here about to um, edit this video and I forgot to answer the most asked question, which is if I got pregnant naturally or if I went through some kind of treatment. And the answer is I got pregnant naturally. Um, and I think it had to do a lot with um, me eating healthy. I think this was the healthiest I've ever been. I was taking care of myself. I was exercising. So, um, yeah. And, of course, prayer. My whole family was praying. Um, Albert's side of the family was praying. They were just all praying for us. Um, but just watching what you eat has to do a lot with it. So, I had... I had, and I'm saying had because I had PCOS and I got pregnant naturally, you guys. So you guys, God answers prayers and I am carrying my little miracle. And I also want to show you guys this cute outfit I bought her from Our Baby Moon in Mexico. This adorable dress with her little Mexican chanclas. How cute is this? I want to show you guys this adorable bassinet that I got on OfferUp. It is from Pottery Barn, and if I'm not mistaken, it is like $200 or $300, and I bought it for $90, and it is so cute and adorable. That is a baby. <laughs> Hola. Hola, mija. Yeah, you can tell a little bit more. Say nada más. Say, I am 29 años y apenas estoy pegando a la pubertidad ya vienes en camino te quiero mucho I really miss you. you you were kicking just like hace un minuto estabas pegándole la pancita aquí so por eso nos pusimos a, a grabarte para que mires cuando estamos Hablando de ver si te acuerdas que te conté de Luna 10. Oh, she wants to go right now. So, this is my 23 week bump date. Bump date? I don't know, whatever. Um, well, you can't really tell because I'm wearing a loose dress. Hold on. Try grabbing it here so you guys can see. Entonces, escúchala. Está frustrada, okay? 
No la hagas sentir mal y déjala dormir en la noche, deja de darle pataditas. Nomás darle patadas cuando estemos despiertos porque te das que pero cuando esté dormida no, ¿ok? ¿Qué, ¿Okay, mija? Respeto a tu madre. Te amo, mi amor. Ya, mi amor, ya, ya hablé con ella. Digo que se va a portar bien. <risa> ok, thanks. <risa>